One report shared that over a recent 12-month period, shoplifting cost American retail stores over $112 billion. This cost is projected to rise above $140 billion in 2025. This impact of stealing is certainly one that hurts society as a whole. Costs to cover losses as well as the needed increase in security will be passed on to consumers and certainly impact salaries for employees. And while there is much debate as to causes, solutions, and punishments, it seems there may also be a growing ambivalence to it by individuals regardless of income, age, or even religion. As sinners, both rich and poor, young and old, we struggle against the temptation to take from others. But God is very clear that we are to give, not take. Stealing property that belongs to others, stealing time through our poor job performance, or using dishonesty for our personal gain are evidences of our sinful and rebellious nature. Since it is God who gives all things as blessings according to His will and purpose, the breaking of this commandment is actually taking from Him. Because of His love and promise to provide such gifts to those He chooses, He tells us in the seventh commandment, you shall not steal. Instead, we are encouraged to help our neighbors guard, grow, and garner possessions while trusting God to provide those things that we ourselves need. Following Jesus, we are transformed from takers to givers, and we commit to his mission to protect the gifts of others that they have received from God. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for all the gifts that you bless us with. Help us to find contentment in those things. Help us also, Heavenly Father, to not steal from others, to take from others, but instead help us to give and to bless others as you have first given and blessed us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.